Hello children, welcome to the session. Today we are going to see 8th Max. This is Aruna Ya Max teacher from Bhadastha Metric I Secondary School Arakonam. The first chapter of rational numbers already we have seen the first 5 exercise and the last 6th exercise is about the rational number between 2 rational numbers we are going to find the rational number. So first we will see what is rational number. A number in the form of P by Q where P and Q are integers. See what is integers? Integers is nothing but a negative number and positive number along with 0. This set of numbers are called integers. Here P and Q are integers and Q is not equal to 0 is a rational number. So first we can mark on a number line. Integers we can mark on the number line. The at the middle it will be 0 and right side of 0 it will be positive that is 1, 2, 3, 4 and etc. Infinite number of numbers we can write on the right side of 0 and left side of 0 is negative numbers which is minus 1, minus 2, minus 3 and infinite number of negative integers also we can write. Now in between minus 2 and 3 how many integers are they? In between minus 2 and 3, the number of integers which is minus 1, 0, 1 and 2. So, how many integers are there in between minus 1 and minus 2 and 3? So, in between minus 2 and 3, there are 4 integers, right? Likewise, we can find for rational numbers too. In rational numbers, in between 2 rational numbers, we can find infinite number of rational numbers. So, how to find the rational numbers? See, rational number between two given rational numbers. So, this is the formula to find the rational number between any two rational numbers. Q is nothing but the representation of set of rational numbers. So, we are going to find Q1. Q1 is the first rational number in between this A and B. A is nothing but the first rational number and B is the next second rational number. Between this two number, rational numbers A and B, we are going to find one more rational number which is Q1. The formula is Q1 equal to 1 by 2 into A plus B. On the number line, if A is here and B, if you are going to find the value of Q1 which lie between this A and B, the Q1 value will be here on the number line. The next Q2 which is the next second rational number if you want to find the same formula 1 by 2 into A plus B. Instead of B we are going to take what value? Q1 value the number which we are going to find for Q2 will lie between A and Q1. So in between this A and Q1 we can find Q2 value. Is it clear? Now if you want third rational number between this A and B again we can use Q3 equal to 1 by 2 into A plus B. In this B value we can take Q2 value. So the Q3 value what we are going to find will lie between A and Q2. So this is Q3 value. Likewise we can find infinite number of rational numbers between any two rational numbers. Is it clear? Using this formula only we are going to solve the exercise problems. The first problem is See, find two rational numbers between minus 11 and minus 10. Minus 11, minus 10, both are negative integers. In between minus 10 and minus 11, whether any integers are there? No, minus 10 and minus 11 are integers. But we can find infinite number of rational numbers in between this minus 11 and minus 10. So, first we will write the formula and we are going to find two rational numbers. So, we are going to find Q1 and Q2. So, first we will take Q1. Q1 equal to 1 by 2 into A plus B. Here, what is A and B? A and B is nothing but A equal to minus 11 and B equal to minus 10. Now, substitute these values in this formula half into A plus B. So, 1 by 2, A value is minus 11 plus B value is minus 10. Now, half 
into minus 11. Remove this bracket. Plus into minus. Plus into minus is minus 10. Now solve these two integers. Minus 11 and minus 10. Both the integers are negative. So both are negative or both are positive. We can add the integers. So minus 11 minus 10. Both are negative integers. So we are going to add this. Which is 1 plus 0. 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. If both are negative, the answer also will be negative. So the answer is minus 21. Which is 1 by 2 into minus 21. Now we want to multiply this numerator with minus 21. Which is 1 into minus 21 is minus 21 by the denominator is 2. Here the denominator we will consider as 1. So 2 ones are 2. So this is Q1 value. Is it clear? The first rational number between minus 11 and minus 10 we find minus 21 by 2. Next we are going to find Q2 value. Already I told you Q2 equal to 1 by 2 into A plus instead of B here we are going to take Q1 value right. So Q1 value is minus 21 by 2 and A value is minus 11 is it clear? Yes substitute this 1 by 2 into minus 11 plus Q1 value is minus 21 by 2 okay. Now here minus 11 we can consider as by 1. Now remove this bracket 1 by 2 into minus 11 by 1 plus into minus minus 21 by 2. Okay. Now how to solve this two rational numbers? The difference of two rational numbers, the denominators are same. It will be easy for us. If the denominators are different, we can take LCM or cross multiplication method. Here we are going to use cross multiplication method. The first step we are going to multiply this 2 with minus 11. So 1 by 2 here 2 into minus 11 which is minus 2 11s are 22 minus the next step 1 into 21. 1 21s are 21 by the product of the denominator which is 1 into 2. 1 2s are 2 is. Now the numerator is minus 21 minus 22 right. So, so to solve the two integers both are in negative I told you to add and the answer also will be negative. So minus 22 minus 21. So now we are going to add this 2. 2 plus 1 is 3. 2 plus 2 is 4. So what answer is this? Is it correct 43 is the answer? When both are negative integers, the answer also will be negative. Yes. So, the answer also negative. Minus 43 is the answer now. 1 by 2 into minus 43 by 2 is the answer. Now, multiply with this 1 by 2. Numerator with numerator and denominator with denominator. So, 1 into minus 43 is minus 43 by 2 into 2 is to do is a 4. So, which is Q2 value. Is it clear? So, we find two rational numbers between minus 11 and minus 10. Likewise, if they ask to find the third or fourth also, we can find an infinite number of rational numbers between two any integers or rational numbers. Is it clear? The Q1 value is minus 21 by 2 and Q2 value is minus 43 by 4. Shall we see the next example? How to find the rational numbers in this? So the next question is find two rational numbers between minus 1 by 2 and 1 by 3. So first uh, we are going to consider this minus 1 by 2 as A value and 1 by 3 as B value. Is it clear? Now we are going to find two rational numbers which is Q1 and Q2. The formula to find the rational number between any two rational number is Q1 equal to S. Q1 equal to 1 by 2 into A plus B. Now we know what is A and B's value, right? 
we can substitute in this q1 formula 1 by 2 into a is minus 1 by 2 plus b value is 1 by 3. So, we need to solve this ra two rational numbers first. So, sum of two rational number we can take cross multiplication or we can find the LCM of this two right. So, here we are going to take cross multiplication of this. So, the next step will be 1 by 2. So, 1 by 2 into here we are going to take cross multiplication which is first step 3 into minus 1. So, plus into minus minus 3 ones are 3 plus the next step we are going to take this 2 that is 2 into 1 2 ones are 2 by the denominator is 2 into 3 2 threes are 6. Now solve the numerator integers which is minus 3 plus 2. So, 1 is negative and 1 is positive. So, opposite signs of integers are given which is minus 3 plus 2. If both are in different sign we are going to subtract here. Now, subtract 3 minus 2 which is 1 is. Yes. Whether this 1 is a positive or negative integer here. So, here the greatest number is negative. So, the answer is negative. When the greatest number is positive, answer will be positive. Okay. So, the answer is minus 1. So, the next step is 1 by 2 into minus 1 by 6. Multiply numerator with numerator. So, which is 1 into minus 1 plus into minus minus 1 by the denominator 2, 6 are 12. So, minus 1 by 12 is the Q1 value which lie between minus 1 by 2 and 1 by 3. Now, we are going to find the second rational number. Next, we are going to find Q2 that is second rational number. In this first, we are going to take A value as 1 by 2 and instead of B, what we are going to take? Q1 value which is minus 1 by 12. So, Q2 equal to 1 by 2 into A plus Q1. So, 1 by 2 A1 value is minus 1 by 2 plus minus 1 by 12. Now, solve this inside the bracket first. Remove this bracket. So, which is 1 by 2 into minus 1 by 2 here plus into minus minus 1 by 12. Now, to solve this two rational numbers, the denominators already I told you we can take LCM or cross multiplication. But here we are going to use the multiples because 2 is the multiple of 12. How many times 2 can be multiplied to get 12? 2, 6 are right. So, if we make 2, 6 are 12, then the denominators will be same and then we can solve the two rational numbers. Whenever you are multiplying the denominator with any number, the same number should be multiplied with the numerator also. So, numerator also should be multiplied by 6. The next step will be 1 by 2. Multiply the numerator minus 1 into 6 is minus 6 by 2, 6 are 12 minus 1 by 12. Now, both the denominators are same. Then we can solve the numerator values which is 1 by 2. Take the denominator 12 and numerator is minus 6 and minus 1. Here numerator 2 integers are in both are in same negative sign. So, minus 6 and minus 1 is there. Both are in the same sign we are going to add the integers that is 6 plus 1 is 7. If both the integers are negative the answer also will be negative. 1 by 2 minus 6 and minus 1 we got the answer as minus 7 by 12. Now we can multiply the numerator with numerator and denominator with denominator. So 1 into minus 7 which is plus into minus minus 1 7 are 7 by denominator 2 into 12 2 12 are 2 12 are 24. So which is Q2 value. So, Q1 value will lie between minus 1 by 2 and 1 by 3 that is minus 1 by 12. Q2 value minus 7 by 24 will lie between minus 1 by 2 and minus 1 by 12. So, we find two rational numbers between minus 1 by 2 and 1 by 3. Likewise, we can find infinite number of rational numbers between any two rational numbers. 
See insert 8 rational numbers between x and modulus x. So x value is minus 5 by 11 and we are going to find modulus of x. Modulus x value is nothing but modulus of x value is minus 5 by 11. So modulus is nothing but the modulus value is always positive. So if it is a positive or a negative rational number the answer will be always positive. So modulus of x equal to modulus of minus 5 by 11 which is 5 by 11. Now we are going to find the rational number between minus 5 by 11 and 5 by 11. We want to give 8 rational numbers in between this two. So we can draw a number line which is at the middle already I told you it will be 0. Right side of 0 it is positive rational numbers. So the denominator is 11. So we are going to take 1 by 11, 2 by 11, 3 by 11, 4 by 11 and 5 by 11, 6 by 11 and it will be going on. And on the left side of 0 it will be negative which is minus 1 by 11, minus 2 by 11, minus 3 by 11, minus 4 by 11, minus 5 by 11, minus 6 by 11 and going on. Right? Now we are going to find the rational number between minus 5 by 11 to plus 5 by 11. So in between this, the rational numbers are there now. This rational numbers are between these two rational numbers. Therefore, the 8 rational numbers are minus 4 by 11, minus 3 by 11, minus 2 by 11, minus 1 by 11, 0 and 1 by 11 positive rational number 2 by 11 and 3 by 11. So we got 8 rational numbers now 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So this 8 rational numbers lie between minus 5 by 11 and 5 by 11. Is it clear how to find the rational numbers between any two given rational numbers? So using this model exercise problems, the remaining exercise problems you can solve by yourself. So with the help of the study material and question bank, practice by yourself and write the self-test for the self-assessment question paper which is attached in the description. Thank you children. I'm going to put it in the